Yo, what's up everyone? This is me once again, your good old buddy, Dentro here. And uh, today, I got something to share with each and every one of you. So a few weeks ago, I was taking my driving test. And from how it works, from where I live, you know, we demonstrate each and every single button in our car of like how the car works for our instructor. That's what we have to go through first. And we also need to go through the driving course where I have to parallel park. Some places in America, like some towns do that, but some don't. But this, but it's what I had to do. And literally, I didn't take, I didn't pass, but I literally chose the wrong day to take my driving test. And here's why. There was construction going on where I was doing it. Like, there was construction on the course. And I couldn't concentrate. And while I was, like, demonstrating every single button in my car what my instructor is telling me, like, what to press. I couldn't hear what he was saying. It was so hard to hear him because of the construction going on. And, um, he also, and also, he was required to be, like, socially distanced while he's, like, instructing us. So, while I was taking my test... He wasn't wearing a mask. He was all up in my face. And he was smoking a cigarette. And he blew smoke in my face. I'm like, bitch, move. Like, come on. And so, my next part of the test, I'm like a driving over to like these orange cans where we have to demonstrate how to parallel park. And while I was parallel parking, I think I might have backed in too quick. But when I put my car, when I put the car in reverse, there's literally a camera behind the car. And uh, once I was backing in, I felt like I was a touch close to the orange cans. But when I was done parallel parking, I... Uh, I was looking to see if I was perfect, which I was, and my instructor, he's like watching me demonstrate what he wants me to do, like 30 yards away. He walks up and he tells me that I hit one of the orange cans, and I'm like, is that a valid judgment call? Because... You were standing 30 yards away, and how can you make that out? He's like a baseball umpire. Like when a pitcher throws what you think is a ball, but the umpire says it's a strike. That's what it was like. So I had to play calm, Bruce Bochy, manager of the San Francisco Giants. Instead of being Joe Girardi using his uh, Italian scream, manager of the Philadelphia Phillies. So, in my head, I wanted to say bad things like, my brother slept with your crippled sister. No. That's not what I wanted to say, but I did want to say it, but I never said it out loud. And it, it just is what it is. I can tell that instructors like him don't, don't like his job. Like, he'll just, like, make a random call. Like, he's out there all day. Like I said, like, he's a baseball umpire. It's been rough. But I'm, take, I'm doing the retest nine or ten days later within that time 
Well, it appears to be it's going to be the end of this video. I thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. How does that sound? Make sure to comment on this video if you could relate to what I've done, or if you have like some sort of funny driving story. And make sure to like this video if you do, and make sure to subscribe for more content like this. Have a good day, everybody.